Hey guys, welcome to Theme Park Fantasy. This is Jace talking to you about Casey's Corner, a classic quick serve located in Walt Disney World in the Magic Kingdom. But before we get into that, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you like the video, and so you never miss travel tips from us whenever you want to go to your favorite theme parks. Alright, let's get into this. So, Casey's Corner, probably one of the most synonymous restaurants with Disney World. I mean, if you've come to Disney before, you know people that come to Disney, this is one of those quick services that always gets brought up in conversation. It's entirely themed around hot dogs. That's it. Nothing fancy, just hot dogs. But they're really, really good hot dogs. And even more than that, I mean, like, they're all beef, real hot dogs. Um... The restaurant also is one of the few that serve foot-long hot dogs. I mean literal one-foot-long hot dogs in a giant bun. These are great, kind of novelty, but really fun if you just want to treat yourself and have fun with them. Um, overall, the, the reason that this restaurant has these hot dog selections is because it's themed to classic baseball. I mean... It's that kind of, you know, 1920s era when people played more in rough dirt um, areas than they actually had actual stadiums. Uh, because of that, you know, you have the classic uniforms. There's a piano outside that used to have a piano player. Um, inside, it's very much themed to the classic, very nostalgic style baseball environment. You know, you have those pinstripes. You have the classic radio announcers kind of thing. Um, this is also where you get your first look at the menu. Like I said, we got hot dogs. That's pretty much it. But they do have specialty hot dogs. Whenever you take a stop here, please keep your eye out because sometimes they will have specialty hot dogs that will revolve throughout the month. Um, these hot dogs will have unique toppings. Like the last one they had before Disney World closed down since this quick service is not open at the time of this video, but undoubtedly will reopen. The one that they had when it closed down was a bacon, cheese, uh, macaroni, and cheese hot dog literally a one we got was a foot long foot long hot dog with macaroni and cheese and bacon on top of it that's what it was i've seen tons of others too they had like tex-mex ones uh they've had um ones with sauerkraut on them it, they do have chili cheese dogs as a standard if that's your thing um they also often have these menu featured items on their tater tots as well tater tots have become a bit of a synonymous item with this restaurant and that is something that they'd like to do is put those right on top of the tater tots um, beyond that, what else do they have? They have a frozen drink section. Uh, if you've watched our video on Pecos Bills, you know that frozen drinks are very good in Florida, but not all that common at Disney World. Uh, at least they're kind of hard to find with consistency. Uh, because of that, I do have to recommend, uh, when you go to Casey's Corner, they actually have a frozen drinks machine. Uh, I believe they usually have a standard frozen lemonade. And then the last time we were there, I actually believe they were selling an alcoholic frozen beverage of some kind. Uh, I don't remember what that was, and undoubtedly it'll be gone by now, but they do had that. They did have that option. Uh, there is desserts at this restaurant, but usually they're just that traditional Disney brownie that you get at all quick serves. So nothing really special there, although I will admit they do change the theming on the brownie every season so like for halloween they'll have some kind of halloween decoration on it and for christmas they'll have some kind of christmas decoration on it you know that kind of thing beyond that i would recommend casey's corner if you're looking for a quick stop for a bite wherever you know you're just getting in at lunchtime at disney world or maybe you're looking for something to have on the way out like you need to pick up something to go you don't want to stop necessarily at the quick serve in your hotel this is a viable option for that i mean it's good food, and it's, you know, cheap for Disney World pricing. With that thought in mind, I'm going to go ahead and leave you with that. Please be sure to like the video if you liked it, and go ahead and check out. We have a large master video now recommending to you all of the restaurants that we love in Walt Disney World. So please be sure to go check that out to get all of our opinions and which one you should see. All right. Uh, this has been Jace for Theme Park Fantasy. Have a great day. Bye.